Tom Dumoulin finishes two seconds behind on the difficult finish to Osimo Simon Yates Mitchelton Scott continued his dominance of the Giro d'Italia 2018 in the Maglia Rosa, attacking his rivals to win stage 11 of the race. Yates launched one of the steep ramps of the final two kilometers of the race, dropping his rivals with 1.4 kilometers to go and holding off the main chaser and second place overall Tom Dumoulin, Sun Web, to take his second stage win of the race. Defending champion Dumoulin finished two seconds back and now sits 47 seconds down on race leader Yates who gained six additional second after time bonuses on the line. Most of the other race contenders finished in the group just behind Dumoulin and second place Davide Formolo, Bora Hans Groe, 8 seconds off the winner, including near rivals Domenico Pazavivo, Bahrain Morita and Thibaut Pino, Groupama FDJ. Chris Froome, Team Sky, suffered another difficult day however, struggling in 40 seconds down on the cobbled finish to Osimo, dropping out of the top 10 overall. Simon Yates wins stage 11 of the 2018 Giro d'Italia, Sonata, how it happened the riders of the Giro Peloton were probably relishing a more modest distance of 158 km on stage 11 compared to Tuesday's 244 km but the race once again began at a ferocious pace. With so many riders eager to get in the break on day that could potentially suit an escape, the bunch sped along at over 50 km per hour in the first half an hour of racing. It took until 125 kilometers to go for the peloton to finally come and settle with a pair up front in Luis Leon Sanchez, Astana Pro Team and Alessandro De Marchi, BMC Racing Team. They were bridged to shortly after by Fausto Masnata, Androni Giocattoli Sidermic and Mirko Maestri, Bardiani CSF, with Alex Turin, Villier Triestina Celitalia, the last to get in the lead group with the four up front waiting for him as he toiled alone between them and the main peloton. The escape established a maximum gap of 3 to 30, but cooperated well despite the gap gradually dropping the closer they got to the finish. It was under 3 minutes within the final 50 kilometers, but it began to really break apart as they dropped Turin and Maestri on a rise with 30 kilometers to go, holding 1 to 50 on the chasing bunch led predominantly by Lotto Fix all in Lotten Al Jumbo. With 15 kilometers remaining, the front three still held a minute's advantage and potentially began to fancy their chances, however the final five kilometers were the most difficult of the stage and they would require a decent advantage to hold off the bunch over the tough finale. Despite a sharp incline at 11 kilometers to go, the brake still held 47 seconds into the final 10 kilometers, while the bunch began to seriously reduce in number with a GC team starting to come to the front. and those movements from the GC teams eventually put paid to the breakaway, who were caught just after the 5 kilometers to go mark despite an additional attack from DeMarkey and Sanchez. Zdenek Stybar, quick step floors, launched the first attack from the bunch with around 4 kilometers remaining, with Tim Wellens, Lotto Fix all joining him to go clear on the technical descent towards the final climb. Zdenek Saibar and Tim Wellens attack on stage 1 of the 2018 Giro d'Italia, Sonata. They established a 7-second gap but were quickly closed down as the GC teams primed their riders for the final fight. As the road ramped up again within the final 2 kilometers, race leader Yates attacked at 1.4 kilometers to the line and immediately gapped his rivals who tried to respond behind. Chris Frome, who was already in a second group behind the one from which Yates attack, dropped even further back as the road ascended. Dumoulin was the rider to get closest to Yates, with the likes of Pino and Pazavivo chasing further back, but no one was able to gain much ground as they struggled up the final, cobble descent. Eventually Yates was able to crest the climb towards the slight downhill finish with Dumoulin almost in touching distance. There was nothing the Dutchman could do to stop the British rider though, and he had to settle for second place as Yates celebrated the win and extending his overall lead. 
Thursday will see the Gyro Sprinters get another chance at victory, with a predominantly flat 214 km run to Imola, 1 Simon Yates, GBR, Mitchelton Scott, and 3, 2, 5, 5, 3, 2 Tom Dumoulin, Ned, Team Sunweb, at 2's 3 Davide Formolo, Haida, Bora Hans Groe, at 5's 4 Alexander Janese, Bra, AG2 Arlamindial, at 8's 5 Domenico Pazavivo, Haida, Bahrain Marita 6 Patrick Conrad, AUT, Bora Hans Groe, 7 Thibaut Pino, Fra, Groupama FDJ, all same time 8 Maximilian Schachmann, GER, Quick Step Floors, at 11's 9 Rohan Dennis, Aus BMC Racing Team, at 18's 10 Fabio Aru, Ida, UAE Team Emirates, at 21's other 23 Chris Froome. GBR, Team Sky, at 40's overall classification after stage 11 1 Simon Yates, GBR, Mitchelton Scott, in 4 7, 8 2 1, 2 Tom Dumoulin, Ned, Team Sunweb, at 47's 3 Thibaut Pino, Fra, Groupama FDJ, at 1, 4, 4 Domenico Pazavivo, Ida, Bahrain Marita, at 1, 1 8, 5 Richard Carapaz, AQ, Movie Star Team, at 1, 5 6, 6 George Bennett, NZL, Latinal Jumbo, at 2, 0, 9, 7 Rohan Dennis, House BMC Racing team, at 2, 3, 6, 8, Palo Bilbao, especially, Astana Pro team, at 2, 5, 4, 9, Patrick Conrad, AUT, Bora Hans Groe, at 2, 5, 5, 1, 0, Fabio Aru, Ida, UAE Team Emirates, at 3 to 10, other 23, Chris Frome, GBR, Team Sky, at 3 to 20.